uh, Grandma Sutra, Grandma Sutra said, okay, but two dates and hasn't made a move, but a hug. We love that. That's the gap. A lot of people think, oh my God, if he doesn't make a move on me, he doesn't like me. What I notice, and this is someone who gets women into relationships at least two or three every week, the guys that don't make a move on the first date and make a move on the second, third, or fourth date, those are the guys that are actually husband and relationship material, if y'all are actually vibing, because they're overly protective of your boundaries and they don't want to mess anything up, so they don't make a move because they have they need to know that they have the green, 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 green light, girl. Yeah, so please understand, that's like A+. plus. That's what you want. You don't want a guy like throwing his tongue in your mouth on the first date. Okay? Yeah. Um, and this is like when my clients tell me this, because they tell me this often, I let them know, great. Keep on working it out. Keep on working it out. Now, if you're thirsty for a kiss, like I am, like I'm a kissing hoe, girl, what you're going to have to do for that next date, for that third date, when you see him, you want to give him a little peck on the cheek so he knows that kissing is okay. That's the green light. Right? After that, girl, y'all be kissing cousins, no shade. Okay?